we started at least a few seconds before 4.30, or 4.40, so here we are. Uh, I'm a little bit early this time. Um, it's a miracle. It, it's just a miracle. Okay. 4.40, and we still got some time to spare. Uh, Lobato hasn't shown up yet. If my voice sounds really weird, it's because I've been sick for a little while. So, apologies for that. It's probably going to carry over for the rest of the stream. Oh, hi. Oh, wait, I, I didn't unmute. Hello? Hi. Can you do a quick um, voice test? I want to see if I should raise my volume. Uh, you mean, like, check the stream? I think it's good the way it is. You sound fine on my end. Okay, good. I I'll do a quick test of the stream as well. Oh, wait, I, I didn't... I yeah, it's good. It's good. Oops. No, I didn't mean to click on Hunger Games Simulator, but... Oh, that's not even being shown on stream anyway, because it's on a different tab, or window, I mean. <laughs> Alright. This is exactly where we stopped off after this intermission. I th yeah, that sounds about right. Oh wait, fuck! I didn't I didn't screen share. Hold on. Yeah. My bad. Let me just do that real quick. I I do love it when my computer buffers whenever I try to do something fun. Uh. <clears throat> excuse me a moment while I while I figure this out. Okay. It 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 unbroke. It, 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 it broken. Let's see. <clears throat> okay, screen share. In, um... And screen share Awful Hospital. So we're going to be reading the webcomic Awful Hospital with Dr. Lobato. We did a stream on this before. Um, yes, hello, it is me, Dr. Lobato. It's true. It's the real Dr. Lobato. From Psychonauts for the- Exactly. <laughs> oh, fuck, I didn't mean to show new to the on stream. Oh. <laughs> there goes my account. Age restricted. It's Jover. <laughs> uh, sorry, everybody, we're gonna have to end the stream now. Yep. <laughs> okay. Anyway, I don't really feel like summarizing this again. Just just look at the last stream if you want- If you want a summary. I'm- I- we gotta get right into the gaming. The shenanigans. I guess it's not really uh, gaming, but... Yeah, you could just skip the fan art gallery if you want. Nah, I think it's cool to look at the fan art. Yeah. We, we got a, we got a Dr. Phage fan art, uh, it, which appears to be of him drawing himself. Of course he is. <laughs> yeah, that seems like something he would do. There's some other... Uh, I think this is supposed to be Fern. Um, these ones are just... This is, this is Miser. The nose... The nose, the nose is deaf still hurts me to this day. How could they do that? <laughs> yeah, lots of good fan art from everyone here. Look, there's an angel <laughs> like how the nose. nose. The angel nose. It's true. Uh, what is this? <laughs> what the hell? Okay, now we have to end the stream. It's Jover. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> is this the precursor to the fucking Among Us? The Am <laughs> that one Among Us shit, yeah. <laughs> Was this made before or after that? Uh, before, definitely. It's it's the precursor to the um, I'm not sure if, Among if, Us. If, I'm not sure if Among Us was even out yet. I think it was out in 2018. So. Yeah, so, so I don't I think it may not have been out yet at the time. Yeah, lots of good fan art here. Yeah, by the way, fun fact, have I ever told you that I played Among Us before it was cool? You did. Okay. Many times. Well, have I ever told you, ha well, have I ever told your viewers that I played Among Us before it was yes. cool? Yes. You, you mentioned it on one of the Hunger Games streams. I know because I rewatch those all the time. Anyway, continue on. You reach the din- Ah, no, fuck it, I'm not reading this. <laughs> I can't do it. I'm still- I'm still recovering from the sore throat, but basically, Fern goes to a place. There's some dim light. A, a filthy oh, you can bear bulb. A filthy bear bulb bolted to the ceiling. There's a door here. The hall continues on into pitch darkness. Cautiously open door. 
The creaky old door opens into a small, musty space containing an exit door and a few other doors, as well as some sort of crude facsimile of, an, of a decorative indoor garden. There's a lot of doors in this webcomic. Yes, that's what that's, I can say. That yes, there tend to be a lot of, of doors inside hospitals. Oh, that's true. Yeah, I don't know why I didn't think of that. But there's also Dr. Man. Well, most doors don't really look like what these doors look like. I mean, I, th there's a good few doors that look like what the Dr. Man door, if you take away the sign. Yeah, that's probably true. I, the the, the middle door, You just though. don't see them often because you're a rich, spoiled brat. True, true. I guess that, that's, a fair, that's a fair point. I like how the only, like, semi-normal looking door is the one that's out of order. Yeah. I, I don't really see a lot of the middle door, personally. But again, maybe a place of privilege I'm speaking from. Uh, check the exit door. <laughs> Rental chatter seems fairly divided on what to do next. Given what you've been told thus far, you can't resist peeking out the exit or anything else. What if it went right back to the real world? What if that's what if that's where your son really is? What if this is still all a wild dream and this is how you wake up? The door says push, but only actually opens when pulled. Weird. That what's wrong with it? It groans on its hinges and scrapes against the swollen wood floor. Your heart races as you open it to find... Nothing. Blackness. No sky and no ground. Nowhere you can even go, and no sign of life. You call out, and you think you hear your voice echo back. But you can't completely tell if that's really what you're hearing or not. Yeah, so the, the, the hospital appears to just be in its own pocket dimension. Yeah, more or less. Oh, fuck, I keep accidentally doxing my name by scrolling into the comments. What? This site is so bad with that. <laughs> I'm just gonna have to trust that no one is gonna try and assassinate me. I'm sure the viewers don't. I, I'm sure. I, I mean. Yeah. So the thing is, every YouTube. See, the thing is, it's part. It's pretty common for YouTubers to have their name, just real name, just be known information. Yeah, pretty much. That's fair. Hi, Dad. I, I'm, oh, I'm we got a, to a friend on in voice. Lotto's chat dad right cameo. Uh, oh, cool. Yes, of course I am. Apparently we're gonna go get ice cream today. Oh, that's nice. I'm- I- I'm glad you are. I can't eat ice cream because of dairy. Oh, you're lactose intolerant? Uh, kinda, yeah. I didn't know that. What a sad, miserable life you must and live. And gluten. I'm- I'm a- I'm a freak- I'm a freaking dairy-aholic. <laughs> Jesus, like, fuck. Have I ever told you that I drink three mugfuls of milk every day? Milk pill dairy cell. Yes. It's that Yes. I have also never broken a bone for probably related reasons. I've never broken a bone. Well actually that maybe that's not true. I'd have to remember really hard. I I I mean I drink stuff that is kind of I just drink water most of the time. <laughs> I also have I told I also it's I at least get to it's funny because like, like the way I drink milk like, is just absolutely free. unhinged. So you may, uh, an eyebrow have, may have already been raised when I said mugfuls of milk and not like glasses of milk. Wait, you drink directly from the? F <laughs> Wait, not from the carton though. What am I saying? You drink from a mug. Yes. That's through not a that. straw. Through a straw. Yes, I drink you're, you're, milk from a mug through a straw. There's a fucking handle on those things for a reason. What? Brother. It just, it just feels natural to me, okay? Okay. And there's less risk of spillage that way. Well, just, just, just drink a bot. just have a bottle! Then, at that point, if you don't want the things to be spilled, I always drink water out of a bottle. I, I, here it is, right on, right on screen. Right on screen, I'm showing it right now. This is my water yeah, bottle. Yeah, well, I gotta use my collection of mugs somehow. <laughs> I guess. I just kind of leave mine lying around without any use. Also, I, have, I like... always warm my milk in the microwave before drinking it. What the fuck? People do that? That's a thing? Yeah, I think it tastes better that way. What? You can warm up milk? Yes. Okay, well, I don't drink regular milk. I only drink almond milk, so I don't know. But this is crazy. What the fuck is going on with milk drinkers? Like, what is this? 
<laughs> oh no, most milk drinkers are not like this. I, it's just me. What the hell are you doing, man? Like, I, 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 I'm kind of astonished. Okay. This is my, this is my quirky character trait. This is the, this is the character trait that the writers of reality gave me so that I wouldn't be seem as normal. True. Oh fuck. Definitely a milk pill dairy cell giving off carton carton core vibes. Yeah. <laughs> okay. What was? Where were we? Uh, she had just looked even out the Fern is disgusted at you. Black fucking void. Oh, even Fern is just shocked at what you just said on stream. <laughs> <laughs> she just heard it through the screen. <laughs> Holy shit! Now I'm kind of glad I'm not a milk drinker. <laughs> oh man! That's... Screen just went black for me. Oh yeah, it's because I clicked off. <laughs> Hold on. And she just leaves. <laughs> and, uh, the door- And now slow, dramatic zoom out. This reminds me of that one shot from Kingpin in Into the Spider-Verse, where he just takes up the entire screen. Not really sure where- but, but, okay. No, I can show you the image. Okay. Oh my god, it just keeps going. And, uh... <laughs> What the fuck? It takes up the entire screen. And now, scroll down. Oh. Fucking jump scare. Man, fuck you. What, what the hell is your problem? Okay, these aren't really that that scary to me. They just look- I like how Yuboa from Yume Nikki is there. What? What do you mean? You know Yuboa from Yume Nikki? No. You play that game? No, I have it's no called... clue what you're talking about. Yeah, well, it's it's that weird... It's the thing that looks sort of like Gaster, the black and white face. What? Back towards the bottom. This thing? Oh, this thing. Yeah. The small yeah, one. That's you... Yeah, that's Yuboa. It's from a game called Yume Nikki. Oh. Yeah, no, never heard of that. Yeah, it's, yeah it's, it's kind of, it's a weird indie game that was made in RPG, it was like made in RPG Maker, but it doesn't really have the battles in it, it's just a game where you explore a weird, surreal landscape full yeah, of that all makes sorts sense. of weird sites. That really checks out. Check one of the other D. Psst, hey you, hey you. Oh, yeah, you f Oh, no, no I'm not supposed to oh, yeah, I, for <laughs> I forgot to for a moment. <laughs> yeah, you figured that thing could probably talk. You barely flinched this time. At least it didn't rush up behind you and murder you. <laughs> I like how that's the bar that's been set so far. <laughs> that's how low fern standards are. <laughs> Engage conversation. Yeah, you. Yes, yes hello. hello mouth. No, I'm reading Fern's dialogue. Okay, okay. I'm yes, sorry, hello, Mouthing. I'm just not reading the description text. Yes, hello, Mouthing. What do you want? Hungry. Of course you are. I suppose you want me to come inside. Well, there's probably some pretty good stuff in here. There is great stuff. Like, wow, I can't even believe how good some of this stuff is. Was that? You know, I, I have no idea. I always wondered myself. Why don't you find out? I'm pretty interesting up close. I bet he's right. Maybe you could describe him for me. I, I have a, I have some concerns of what is going on here. Uh... Ask oh, to see no inside. Problem. Oh, no problem. Always here to help. Anything you like, meaty cakes? What the fuck sort of thing is that supposed to... What do you mean, meaty cakes? <laughs> the teeth are attracted to the surrounding flesh more like a cat's talons than a set of jaws. You still can't see where the other voice is coming from, but you can see a variety of objects in there, most of them severely deteriorated, except for something glinting on a wooden on an old wooden crate. Interesting. I don't suppose you would want a cupcake, would you? Maybe an apple? Are they the meat kind? The meat kind? No, I, I don't think they are. Jeez, meat dummy. What? Really? Is, is that true? Uh, no, not at all. I would never be made of meat. 
You can't trick me, I can smell it! Come on, don't be stingy. How am I even gonna get any sleep on an empty me? I kinda need it, sorry. Oh come on, you've got all kinds of weird lumps and branches. I can't all be important. Nothing needs that many bits. What do you know? There, you're a room. Am I wasting my time here, or do you know your deep fuck? Do you know anything important? I know you're gonna need this nice shiny key if you ever want to see that kid of yours. I haven't mentioned. Oh, how does he? How does it know? Not yet. It doesn't feel like either of these things are invading your head. Like, like. You haven't mentioned that yet, and it doesn't feel like either of these things are invading your head like those other doors. Damn. We got a mystery here. How does that thing know? Well, maybe because she's gone around the whole place talking about her son, so that could explain it. You know, I don't think it's ever actually been explained how it knows, at least so far. I, I guess it could have heard from, like, something else, because she has gone around the entire hospital talking about how she wants to find her son. Hm. Yeah. Offer it, it me that isn't you. The door network. <laughs> yeah, you're not gonna let the these bozos let the better of you get the get the better of you, no matter what they know. How about this? I bring you meat and you cough up the key. Also, I won't stab you in the eye. Please, I've got more where that one came from. But I like the meat part. For making a deal here, I won't settle it for just any old meat. Oh, really now? Yeah, I want one of those sloppy joes they make in the cafeteria. I can't even remember the last time I had one. They're fantastic. Oh yeah, bring us one of those and I'll really fill you in. Alright, that doesn't sound too bad. I'll think about it. <clears throat> Still not sure messing with this thing is a good idea. Or if its friend is even telling the truth about the morgue. You figure you should explore a little more before you go around wantonly feeding doors like an animal. Don't we all sometimes? Take the sticky note already. Hug, fine, they win. You'll take the damn note. Okay, great, now you're officially regarding your own thoughts as they. At least you know you're still the sanest thing you've met here. That's the sad Acquired. thing is that's definitely true. Acquired out of order note. Alright. Keep through the Dr. Mandor. So the exit went to nowhere, and the other door wants a sandwich or some crap. That just leaves the half-rotten door labeled Dr. Man in ominous lettering. Hopefully whatever Dr. Man actually is, it doesn't wait on the other side of peoples to eat eyeballs or something. <laughs> Number zero dad. <laughs> <laughs> he has gone above and beyond. Truly. <laughs> He's become the infinity dad. The M in man stands for Mugen. I don't think you get it, but it's... <laughs> I do not. Mukin is Japanese for infinity. Ah. Uh. Infinity dad. <laughs> Incredible. It's an actual human, too. Oh, okay. Cautiously knock. Or at least it's human adjacent. Yeah. It's the only sensible thing that's occurred to you right now. You're not sure you want to piss off whoever or whatever this guy is by sticking weird things through his door hole or something. You knock softly three or four times, ready to whip out your weapon if this guy has a face made of leeches or something. The figure turns toward you agonizingly before slowly speaking. Ah, visitors. It's not locked. Yet. Haha, <laughs> Dr. Jokes. He's an odd- not Oh, wait. My bad. He's- He's an oddly shaped being, but not inhumanly so. Not quite. His voice is deeper than you might have expected. A Boris Karloff quality. His inflection could best be described as cheerfully emotionless. I, I don't really know what that means, but... Mm. Question time. You open the door, but you don't come all the way in, just in case. Dr. Man? Uh -huh. That's what they call me. I... what? Why is... I... Just... Please, take your time. Are you a human being? <laughs> Ever since I was born. They say it's another... They say it's genetic. That's another joke. But why are you here? Why am I here? Is... I just... Is this some other dimension? Oh, no. Oh, no. Dimension is a quaint notion. No, no, this is merely the hospital, and I am a doctor. 
Where else does a doctor belong? But where did you come from? Virginia. <laughs> Virginia! <laughs> that, such a casual answer just completely threw me off. <laughs> and how did you get here? Walked. <laughs> how? <laughs> he, just, he just walked through the void. <laughs> he had Frostwalker or something on his boots. <laughs> yeah. I guess the void doesn't have water, so that doesn't count. <laughs> he used shulkers. <laughs> he had levitation potions. True story. <laughs> Continue conversation. I'm about to say- I would like to make it point out something very cursed. What? Sans Undertale. Fuck you. <laughs> this guy doesn't seem to be all there, and you're not sure you want to agitate him, or tell him too much about yourself just yet. What can you tell me about the other doctors here? Oh, I can't complain. Fine practitioners throughout <laughs> most of the perception range, best in their fields. What do you know about Dr. Miser? What's transfusionating exactly? Ah, fine young lad. Best transfusionator in the range. Cutting edge procedure. Shift zones without entanglement. What the fuck does any of that mean? None of these words are in the Bible. <laughs> huh? What's all this I keep hearing about zones and perception? Oh, nothing to worry about. It's merely the foundation of all that does and does not exist. It's nothing at all. If you're truly curious, I'm afraid I am but a humble doctor, not a teacher. Can't anybody just tell me where we are? Where is this hospital exactly? Why was there nothing outside? <laughs> there was nothing outside because outside is nothing. The hospital is the hospital. There is no in or out. But, but that's nonsense. I wasn't here before and now I am. Why would a hospital exist if there isn't anywhere else to go? How would you even know it's a hospital? You said you came fr you just said you came from Virginia. What if I wanted to see Virginia? How would I leave? Oh dear, you still don't understand. I suppose you never can. Not with that stunted core of yours. If you are here, it is surely because you are unwell. Most unwell to attract the attention of such a venerable medical staff. If you desire the world you knew, you will have to be discharged. Dr. Man moves his arms for the first time you've seen, finger quoting around a world and abruptly folding them behind his back again. Why are you the only human I've seen? Are there any others? On the staff, I'm afraid Well, there's not. Jay, but I don't know if he shows up yet. Yeah, he, he doesn't show up for a while. Okay. Yeah, anyway. On the staff, I'm afraid not. Just as Miss Tori as a, is our only tubes owner. Budget cuts. <laughs> Naturally, patients come and go from all layers of the range. So, there are more human beings here. There were. And what happened to them? Ah, uh, this and that. <laughs> they can't all be success stories. You're in the hospital, after all. You either heal, or you do not. I see. At least that's basically normal. I guess I don't know what kind of answer I expected. That other room wanted something from the cafeteria. The thing inside said it would trade me a key for it. Oh, <laughs> I don't doubt that it intends to uphold its prime. It's to the best of its ability. You must have passed the cafeteria to end up here, I'm sure. Fine young doors, sharp-witted. You might enjoy the flan. Okay, um, is there anything I should know about this phage guy? About who now? Booming voice nearly topples you. Neither his tone nor his facial expression change. Not a twitch. He just, he just, he just wrote me when I suddenly raise my Discord volume. Yeah. Uh, nothing. Nobody. You're still, oh. You're still shaking a little from the sheer volume of his outburst. At least you get the egg leg he might not like Phage any more than you do. Uh, listen, I just, I'm really looking for my son. He was very sick for a very long time, and the next thing I knew, I was here in the hospital alone. I don't know where he is or what could be happening to him. Whatever's going on, I need to be able to see him. Oh, ha, why didn't you say so? That is quite the pickle. My, yes, elephantine gherkin, that. 
They would have taken him to the maternity ward. It's also pediatrics and anything else that details in the medicine of children, larvae, spores, and subtones. I'm afraid he is in quite the pickle. I like that Dr. Mann is like one of the few characters who is actually kind of helping and telling us information. Yeah. <laughs> he seems like a one decent guy. Yeah. Continue conversation. What? What do you mean a pickle? What are they doing to him? Oh, well, I don't doubt they're doing their best to treat whatever condition they've diagnosed him with. But you can't expect just the average neurosurgeon to know how to treat, to know how to treat say, an octopus. Not even the best of the field. <laughs> I thought you said regular humans have been healed here. Oh, and they healed, yes. They weren't always healed by the staff, though that has also certainly happened. Throw enough against the wall, as they say. That is not a good are... motto for a hospital. That is very bad. <laughs> they are the best in the perception range, but the range is vast. Even they can understand only fragments and only from their own respective sub-ranges. I'm afraid they simply wouldn't know one of our flu vaccines from a needle full of mercury. Can't blame them, really. That's precisely what works for a Vogu who's already patient out of the quasi acoustic. It, this is moments. all really concerning. This is really bad. <laughs> How do I get into the maternity ward? You work here, can't you do something? <laughs> I'm afraid you will need the passcode from an individual. Yes, He's talking about Phage. Yes, a fine, upstanding individual I cannot rightfully complain about, but whom shall remain lameless. That's Phage. Unfortunately. Unfortunately, well, I can't say for certain how cooperative anyone on staff may be. They likely believe you warranted a quarantine for your own safety, and I'm afraid it would be my professional opinion against theirs. <laughs> I must haven't much authority outside my humble little sector. I specialize in, in patients fresh off the paraviolet zone, not a high priority to the rest of the facility, but fundamentally similar in many ways to you or I. If you can bring him here, I can give him an examination of my own. We can proceed from there. Yeah, I'm I'm pretty sure he's talking about Phage. <laughs> hey, Gamma's here. Oh, hi, Gamma. Gamma, do you want to do a quick test with the TTS voice? Wait a fucking minute, I think I'm on the wrong... Hold on. I need to be on the channel, right? Yeah. Okay, Gamma, tight... Do slash TTS in general chat on this cha on the server. Do it now. What do you mean? Do you don't have per? Oh fuck. Okay, I'm stupid. Hold on. Let me just stop the stream for a moment and give Gamma a roll on the server. All right. I, I don't know, I guess I didn't really think that was going to be a problem, but yeah, it is. Let's see how chat's doing in the meantime. Uh, the chat ha is, uh... Empty? I think I forgot to ping everyone. Yeah, I think you did. <laughs> yeah. I, 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 I really did. I was going to ping everyone once the stream started. Um, unfortunately, Discord is now frozen, so I now have to wait even longer before I can do that. So, uh, not oh, only that, I have I to wait. Maybe I everyone for you? Do it. Actually, I don't think you can use that channel in announcements. Fuck it, I'm opening my phone and, and fixing this. I'm just gonna use my phone, because Discord is broken. Ugh. I did not really consider any of this. Uh, forgot to ping earlier. Stream is in progress. <laughs> That's awkward. Okay. Now I just need to wait for Discord to work again. It 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 it, it it's just frozen. It 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 won't it won't work. Not at all. Period. <laughs> Are you still hearing me, Lobato? I think Discord just actually broke. It's Jover. Let me just... I'll try and reopen Discord and see if that solves anything. It's still fucking frozen. 
Okay, technical difficulties then. I can't stop sniffing. I didn't know you were going to join the stream yet. Okay. That's why it's not Feet, Lobato, and Gamma, but I will change it in a moment. Hold on while I give you some roles. Uh, members, I give you perms. Uh, gamma roll. How the fuck do I... How do I give you perms? Uh, roles. I'm just gonna create one real quick. I'm just gonna speed run the creation of this role. Fuck it. I'm just gonna give Gamma a managerial position. I'm giving us all managerial positions. Okay. There you go. Okay, well he has the role now. Now I just need Discord to not die. Do not violently kill itself. How do I do- how do I fix that? I guess I have to- I don't think I have a choice but to go on onto the website. I think I have to just go and open Discord on the website because I can't use the app right now. Let's just log on from there. This fucking sucks. Okay, discordapp.com. Lame as shit. I don't know why I'm- why is this open like this? Okay. Well, we're just going to log on to Discord from there and and try to solve the problem. Come the fuck on. Okay, I need to get back fast. Gamma, you have... Whoa. Finally. Finally, I'm back. Finally. Can you guys hear me? Yes. I had to open Discord on a website because my app kept freezing. Gamma, you should have perms. I gave everyone... I gave everyone fucking admin. You should be able to type TTS. Hey, by the way, you missed my rousing performance of Story of Undertale. I'm so sorry. There's nothing I could have done. What do you mean it doesn't work? I thought we tested this earlier. Oh, that fucking sucks. Do you use slash TTS? No, it works on servers because A got it to work. What? No. I think you have to put a message after it, though. Okay, what the hell? What is it, Dad? Lobato what? died cameo again. Okay, I'm just muting him for a moment. Okay, well, now we're just kind of stumped. Sorry to the one viewer watching this stream who has to witness the scuffness. Uh... I... The, wait, you can just play stuff from your... Wait a minute, Gamma. You can just play sound effects? Can you not, like... Can you, can you do something like that? And then have that translate into, like, text-to-speech words? Is that possible? Okay, Lobato, is your dad gone yet? Uh, he wasn't even- he wasn't even in the room, he was calling to me from downstairs. Oh. Yeah, Gamma apparently can't use TTS, even though it- it-, it, it even though he should be able to. Okay. Gamma can at least play sound effects, though. <laughs> Thank you. 
I'll... <laughs> Guys, this is, I, I want to say that be, I know this how to solve how this Gamma problem. This will be how Gamma interacts with the stream. He just plays sound <laughs> effects. Yeah. I, I really want to say I have a solution. I, I don't. I literally don't know how to fix this. Because by all, by all accounts, the TTS thing should work. Because it worked for Anyway, if you'll excuse me one moment, I'm going to go take a piss. Okay. Should we move on to a different server and maybe see if that works? Double check the thingamabobs terms. Server settings. Gamma, you should have admin role. Like, you literally have admin perms. I have no idea how you're not able to do that. Let me just look up admin and then just... Oh. Oh, apparently I didn't, I didn't actually give them anyone admin perms. Okay. Try now. Try now. I, it appears I just failed to give you. 50 50th Scandi said I finally speak. Finally. It works. Can you test that again? Fifty fiftieth Scandi said hi. Yes, perfect. Okay. Good, good, good. Okay, try again. Rahul said yo. Yes, okay, we got it. We got it, it works. I think someone left a chat message anyway. Let me let me just I'm editing right now. This is hilarious. Thanks, Vex. Uh, hi, William. You're like half an hour late. That's my fault. I I I didn't ping for the stream. That's entirely my fault. Well, Gamma's here. Uh, I might as well change it so that it's uh. I'm gonna I'm gonna change it so that Gamma is also in the title, featuring Doctor Lovato and Gamma. All Gamma Raul, I guess, is more accurate. Terrible pronouncing. All right, well, time to just wait for Lobato to get back from the piss. And then we're good. Definitely not a scuff stream. Everything went perfectly. Nothing happened. That was bad. It all went perfectly well. If you persevere, you can do anything. Alright, are you back yet, or...? Okay, apparently not yet. I'll just, uh, wait a moment longer. How's everyone's day been? How, how, you know... How, how, how are you guys feeling? What, what's it like in the chat? How is it going? I return. Did you, oh, did hi, you, Gamma. Did you specifically play that sound effect for your return? Uh, uh, Gamma played that. Gamma played it? Perfect timing. Okay, Gamma, try TTS again, just to make sure it still works. Rahul said I added a thing. Okay, yep. Here we go, we can finally continue. That was definitely not scuffed. Everything went perfectly fine the first attempt. Yes. Yes, ignore how long it took for the stream to actually get back. Of, co of course. The stream actually never cut out. It, uh, all those errors started. Regardless. Uh, leave, take, duck. Uh, uh, by, uh, uh, can you screen share, please? Oh, I, I unscreen shared? Yes. Oh, right, because I switched, I switched from the app to the website, that's right. Hey, by the yeah. way, did you actually ping everyone? I did ping everyone, yes. There okay. are already more people on the screen. On the stream. Cool. Okay, yeah, well, I, got I should be screen sharing now. Eve, take duck. Yeah, you bid the creepy but maybe helpful duck their goodbye and give... 
give in to the stop tabbing out. Give in I, to I, the weird ongoing. I can't. What do you mean tabbing? Stop. Out? I'm not doing anything. I think it's just a glitch. The stream's cutting out for some reason. It's not my fault. I think it's top now. Okay. <laughs> I jinxed it. Fuck. It's Jover. <sighs> Hold on, I'm gonna just. There I'm just is, gonna quickly. There is a solution. Um, I would have to restart the app, but the app is frozen. Wait, wait, wait. Let, let me try. Let me try leaving and rejoining to see if that fixes anything. Yeah, that might fix something. Yeah. Is it still spazzing out for you? It is not. Okay, good. Oh, if I spoke too soon, no! god fucking damn. No! No! You gotta be shitting me. You gotta be kidding. Can't be Why serious. Why is everything going wrong? Okay. Um, well, I have to restart this. But, as in, like, the app. But the issue with that is that the app is perpetually, and I know from experience that the only way to unfreeze it is to literally restart my entire fucking computer. So I'd have to t I'd have to stop the stream for like a solid five minutes. I really don't want to. <laughs> hmm. Might be the only thing we can do at this point. God fucking damn it! I don't know why Discord had to just freeze. Maybe if I, I don't know Discord why Discord as... had to freaking glitch out the stream like this. Neither do I. Maybe if I... Okay, maybe if I run Discord as administrator, I can open it and, and it won't die. I'm not 100% sure. Uh, I'll try running it as an administrator and see if that does anything different. Okay. No, it doesn't. It's still on the same front that it was before. I, I'm just, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna deafen myself and and switch to watching a video. Ping me when, ping me when you've sorted this out. Yeah, I'm out. gonna have to restart my entire computer, I think, in order. To it. So the stream's gonna be okay, down okay. for five minutes. Okay, do. Okay. Yeah, just a sec. Be on in, in a few minutes. Okay, yeah. Uh let's just uh let's just cut this short. Is it is it is it good? Are we are we are we gaming? Are we gaming? I can't be a hundred percent sure yet. Haven't seen the stream actually resume. Okay, yep, it seems like the stream's back. Good? Are we We're we're good, okay. Getting Lobato back. Okay. We're good. We are good. Dream went down for a few. I, I need okay, it's both of you. Okay. Well, I'm doing the stream solo now. Sorry, guys. It's Jover. It is all Jover now. Hey, guys, you're gonna stop playing sound effects. Nobody's playing sound effects. Oh, I think it's just Gamma. Uh, are you gonna screen share? Yes. I forgot I was watching the stream. <laughs> that makes sense. Okay. Here your screen. 
off of hospital seriously the worst ever, and we're back. This isn't spazzing out for you, right? Ah, uh, hold on, it's buffering. Okay. That it... seems fine. Okay, good. Leave, take duck. You bid the creepy but maybe helpful doctor goodbye and give in to the weird ongoing urge to take that rubber duck. Sure, why not? Acquired rubber duck. Impressive. Insane. Head back to the cafeteria. You step back out into the cold, dark hallway and turn back the way you came, but don't get far before a small, peculiar shape comes babbling, comes bobbing out of the dark, off, comes bobbing out of the dark, small feet wetly smacking the old rot rotten wood. The rambling, the rambling evil, evil colorectal oh, polyp attacks. Oh, this thing. It's been in the Hunger Games before, right? Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Yep. I remember this thing. Howdy, stranger! That's your one cozy smelling lower intestine you got there! Oh, oh no! no. <laughs> Use baby kidney stone. Why is that a fucking Pokemon battle? Your dope back is actually already shaking as the thought occurs to you. Before you can even reach inside, the living kidney stone springs out of its own volition, landing between you and the hor oh, horrible polyp. It snickers softly, but, it st but still doesn't seem able to speak. <laughs> Holy fuck. Insane. Top 10 anime battles. <laughs> <laughs> the kidney stone and walking to her to egg turns tackling each one another, the crystal lean here and egg jabbing and thrusting with its rugged thorns. The polyp is surprisingly nimble, dancing casually around every attack to rebound with a smack of its gelatinous feet to the stone's flatter, unprotected underside. You're standing idly by, not sure whether to flee while the monster is distracted or if there's something you could do to help the spiny, giggling bladder rock. It may be disturbing, but it is trying to protect you. <laughs> I gotta get out of Boston, man. <laughs> Tuesdays. Ron will send Posey check Discord RQ. <laughs> you lose your weapon. The polyp just keeps charging the what about own spot. The polyp just keeps dodging the stone spines, but no longer paying attention to you. It's the perfect chance to splatter the horrible thing with your stick. If it would just slow down for a second. Yeah. Uh, what do I need to check Discord for? Where on Discord? Alright, I seem to have a notification from the, from the voice chat, which doesn't make much sense, but... What is going Raul on? said I ping you. Why would you do that? But why? And also, how do you ping someone in the voice chat? I, don't, I didn't know that was a thing you could do. Rahul said there's a built-in VC text chat. There is? Rahul said focus on there. I don't know where it is. How do I access it? Oh, in, in the top right of your screen, there's a there's a little speech bubble icon. Oh wait, yeah, yeah top right. Oh, right. oh, oh, yeah. No, I have that open now. You can use that. Uh, your the test didn't work. Try again. Rahul said test. Okay, that works. <laughs> use your weapon. The polyp just keeps dodging the stone spines, but no longer paying attention to you. It's the perfect chance to splatter the horrible thing with your stick if it would just slow down for a second. Are you gonna scroll down? I I, I did. Ah, fuck! My screen froze. Hold on. Okay, just just close out of the screen. I swear to God, I, I, I think someone's trying to sabotage our stream. Yeah, okay, okay, you got me. <laughs> what is even going on at this point? 
<laughs> the two horrible maladies rolled over each other, giggling. They're playing. They were playing all along. <laughs> They're taking the Pollock wit. Before you could even really decide, the gross thing comes hopping up into your tote bag, which is suddenly in your hand. You're really beginning to wonder where it goes when you're not using it. You're going to lug Shadow a talking realm. colon. You're going to lug a talking colon tumor around now, and you don't even know how. Acquired, Acquired rambling evil colorectal polyp. <laughs> the bag is just a magic item that thing. The west. Oh, leave hall. The West Wing is just how you left it. You're guessing those doors you spoke with earlier are to the cafeteria. Now that you think of it, Ron the smell said of meat you mind me as I share this stream in another server. Meat. Uh, can you do that? Are you allowed to share the stream in another server? Is Gamma allowed to do that? Ramul said the video. Yeah, yeah. You can definitely. Now that you think of it, the smell of- oh, yeah, we already read that. I read that. Okay. Enter cafeteria. Oh, fuck, what am I looking at right now? The cafeteria. Yeah, you decide to act casual good. about- uh, You decide to act casual about this like you belong here. Now, don't you? Whoever heard of a hospital where the patients aren't allowed in the cafeteria? You put on your most casual facade as you stride right through the greasy double to- Okay, yeah, no, this does not look like a very nice cafeteria. Emergency meeting. <laughs> Emergency meeting, we need a cleanup. Yeah, I think that applies to the whole hospital, honestly. <laughs> True. You're not wrong. Why are about sloppy joke? It's difficult to see you through the cafeteria's sickly greenish haze, but there's something or other standing behind the counter. Something with huge, unblinking greenish eyes, and it has yet to make any threatening Ronald move. Said, inquire you cover about your mouth with top. your shirt as best no! as you can while still asking. No, Gamma, no. No. Not inquiring <laughs> oh. about Sloppy Top. Oh god, you are- you are not- <laughs> You cover your mouth with your shirt as best as you can while still asking the being if they're serving any sloppy joes. The thing sighs audibly, slumps a little, and gazes sadly to the floor. It retreats slightly, and through the rancid fog, you think you see one of its large, lumpy hands beckoning you to follow. Need to kick him off the sh- <laughs> <laughs> Behind, oh, wait, never mind. Behind the counter, the miasma is thinned by sputtering ceiling vents, and faint lights illuminate. No, are they serious? What the hell? It's a hamburger, or maybe it's a cheeseburger. Whatever. Things squirm in its rancid, dribbling ground beef. Its unblinking eyeballs bulge hungrily. It's such a ludicrous sight, you almost don't notice the blood-stained cleaver. I almost didn't notice that. If it's a fight, this guy Ron wants. Ronul said the TDS doesn't pronounce the double dashes I placed on the message. Sad face. Tragic. <laughs> the culinary abomination buries its cleat in a large chopping block and smiles. Let's call that a smile. Why not? Apparently, the burger means no harm. Seduce the sandwich. What the yeah. fuck? That's a real suggestion someone made, huh? <laughs> yeah, yeah. There's an AO3 no. fanfic for this somewhere. <laughs> yeah, I actually wonder if there is. are said seduce it. Yeah, awful hospital. We're not seducing the same. There might be. Yeah. I'm sure you could find, like, one or two. We are not seducing <laughs> the Seduce me! <laughs> Holy fuck. Holy Ron fuck. Ronald said this is non-negotiable. It is highly negotiable, actually. We are not seducing Seduce the hamburger. Me. Oh my god, look at the amount of people who said this. Yeah. Ronul said, why does it pronounce is like that? I don't know. And one person recommended they seduce the burger with a bucket of fried chicken. <laughs> True. 
God, look. Hello there, Mr. Meats. Your, your lettuce is crispy and your eyes are firmly glued on. Wait, she's actually going to? <laughs> no, on second thought, that sounds like a great idea for no. some reason. She was pure pressured by the voices. <laughs> Oh my god, I think Gamma's non-negotiable tactic actually worked. Yeah. <laughs> Gamma activated time travel and made it work somehow. <laughs> He's too powerful. Rahul said Vex said this is my favorite erotica reading ever. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna get my channel age restricted. Why did she is turn this, into this, a fucking anime girl? Is, is this turning into a dating sim? If this turns into a dating sim, I swear to God. <laughs> Rahul said Fern Remember, you Miku. have to read Fern's dialogue. No! I did this to myself. No! <laughs> I'm getting Rahul my channel said Fern became Miku. <laughs> oh... Oh my, a huge, disgusting sandwich. How charming. Is that jerk seasoning? Cause you're Jamaican me crazy. <laughs> I can't, I'm, I can't fucking read this. You work out too? I killed a kidney. What? I don't even know how to read this. Stonely, a kidney, stonely mom? A kidney I stones. I killed a kidney stones mom. Oh, okay. Yeah, wow, remember you only that? barely smell like a Wendy's dumpster. You have important purposes for your meat. These are barely <laughs> even flirts. <laughs> what what is this even supposed to accomplish? <laughs> oh, this is so funny. Option four. You try out a hokey double entendre on the Champlain mass of ground animal flesh and stick. Oh, Brad, it recoils immediately. Is that good? Is, is that what we want to do? Are we doing this for a reason? The, the burger. burger is visibly uncomfortable. Awesome! Hospital food service must behave good pretty good, right? Is that a millipede, or are you just happy to see me? Hey, wait, are you a dude Ron or a lady said that implies that burger has millipede boners for your face. Why do you even say things? Why do we even let you speak? Come on, you know you're loving it. <laughs> That's supposed to be a McDonald's reference. Jesus. Fuck. Of course it is. <laughs> <laughs> I like how one of these is just asking a question. About yeah. <laughs> Option one. That, that didn't feel quite right. Why is it cowering? What did you even say? For some reason you want to ask how much money it makes now. Why am I even doing it? You, me, and a bunch of leta- wait, what? A bed. Can we start over? <laughs> I just need some help, is all. I'm sorry, it's the, uh, bumblebees talking? Bumblebees? Devour, consume, bloat with its flesh. What the fuck is even <laughs> happening at this point? This is the this is this is this is definitely not a successful dating sim. Yeah. Rahul said sacrifice to the global the Doki Doki literature club is a little bit looking even weirder than usual. <laughs> True. Uh, what is even happening at this point? <laughs> it just says no. no. Amazing. I don't know who or what you are, and I don't know what kind of sick game you think this is, but I'm pretty sure you're real at this point, and that was not okay. You may have been helpful here and there, but you're not turning in me into some puppet for your twisted entertainment. Look what you're making me do. I don't even know what to yell at, so I'm yelling at a ceiling light. And now I even look ridiculous compared to a huge sandwich, which you totally roped into whatever disgusting nonsense you thought you were pulling, and now I have to apologize to a huge sandwich. Why is that my life? Why did I even just break in half? I, what the hell was that? I couldn't even see anything. I just knew it was there. Ugh! I'm not listening to you. I mean it this time. I can do this on my own. Rahul said, is her mouth open or does she have a big ass frown? <laughs> I, I, I think it's a frown. Or a, actually, you know what? Both could make sense. 
I, I feel like either makes sense at this point. Yeah, I, I was thinking that too. <laughs> oh. I like the I like burger's expression in the background. The poor burger is just... I like how it says you crossed out with me. Ernest just starting to take it from the from the from the from the reader. Yeah. <laughs> I actually tried to put in effort voice acting <laughs> that part. Yeah, now that since Fruit is in full control, you're gonna have to be the one reading the narration now. <laughs> oh, he's in full control now. Okay. Don't worry, it's temporary. Rahul said owned. I apologize to the weird food person, assuming it that it, it that it didn't assume. Uh, no, fuck. I apologize to the weird food person, assuring it that it, I didn't mean to be such a creep and that it wouldn't happen again. I hope not. Anyhow, <laughs> my main my mind could still pick up on things, whispering to one another and probably trying to communicate with me like they've been trying since I work like I woke up here. But I couldn't quite tell what they wanted anymore. I was choosing not to, and it was actually working. It felt good to know I could shut out whatever the hell or whatever they are when I wanted to and that they seemed to be accepting it for the time being. I followed the hamburger for quite a while down a long, tubular metal tunnel, ducking behind myself every so often given what's happened to me twice now. This particular thing seemed pretty harmless, at least. It did put its cleaver away, and it didn't even Developers! Make... Developers! 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 Would you please developers! stop doing that? It did put its cleaver away, and it didn't even make any move to defend itself when I turned into a skeevazoid. I'm not even going to pretend I know what that means. Oddly enough, it wasn't even looking or smelling as rancid as it had only moments ago. It was even a little appetizing. Maybe it was because we were out of the cafeteria, or maybe it had to do with those things in my head. The tunnel opened into a mind-boggling new space, some sort of absurd plant or factory where meat was being processed. Why did the hospital cafeteria need this much meat? Surprisingly, the place smelled more like candy than a slaughterhouse, and the mechanical sounds around me would have played great club music. It all should have been terrifying, but I felt amazingly safe, even fascinated. I couldn't recognize any of the dead stuff, but at least that ruled out any of it being human. I knew the place could just be screwing with me, getting into my head like other things that won't be mentioned because they're jerks, and I still totally wasn't listening to them, but the burger hadn't threatened me yet. Just in case, I kept one hand on my stick thing. The kidney stone stabber thing. You know what? I'm going to call it a sword. A crystal sword. Yeah, I'm like, uh, whatever you call a lady who fights with a sword. Does that have a name? Damn it, I don't even think it does. <laughs> we eventually came to an open area dominated by an unreasonable gigantic sausage grinder. It had a face, of course, and I could tell it was unwell, because obviously a giant sausage grinder can catch a cold or whatever. I kind of gave up questioning how things work around here, somewhere between the spleen of the existential angst and the butt tumor living in my invisible tote bag. At the end of the rickety catwalk, which was apparently su suspended Rahul by nothing at all. said these guys were in the JC. True. At the end of the rickety catwalk, which was apparently suspended by nothing at all, was another new figure. I could make out an almost human-like shape, but the head was a bit too large. And these guys Rahul were literally said that's in the why JC. I told you to watch out for spoilers. <laughs> yeah. The humanoid what's it, overlooking the huge grinder, slowly turned its huge metallic head as I approached. It seemed to be a giant pressure cooker, maybe a barbecue grill. Oh, hi there, little meatlet. I didn't see you there. Excuse my rudeness. I'm BBQ girl. Oh no, it was a barbecue grill, and it was a pun. Why couldn't I have woken up in an evil monster universe that didn't make puns? There can't just be the pun one, right? May as well get the sandwich business over. Rahul said, okay, hear me out, slash J. No. Come on. Okay, I kind of get it. Conversation mode. Fern's way hotter, though. True. Rahul said LMAO. <laughs> so, Joe, ma'am, I can't get hospital, off thank you. Hospital. <laughs> Rahul said L email. We're just so, Joe, ma'am, I take it the hospital said you? I didn't know they hired another gray. Rahul said lame L. Joe, ma'am. Oh yeah, must be getting desperate. <laughs> Actually, I know this will sound weird, barbecue person, but a door made of teeth is insisting I bring it. Oh, Sloppy Joe, oh yes, it loves those to death. <laughs> Unfortunately, Bug Prince, that would be the signature sandwich of our dear friend Chuck, and he is unwell. Bug 
Yeah, yeah, I caught that from the giant thermometer and ice pack. That makes positively no sense. What's wrong with him? He ground something recently that didn't agree with him, argued all the way down, and wouldn't you know it, peeled off a reverberator into one of his gel cores. I'm surprised you couldn't tell by the vibrations, kangaroo. All right, silly me. Of course, sorry, I'm a tricky. With that many I... With that many heads? I... Already made of matter? I, er, that's, I mean... Well, it's about time to branch out. Good for you, crab walks. The thing didn't know how to address a human, or whatever it thought I was, and it was as daffy as everything else I'd run into. I can't say I like the way its Mickey Mouse eyes kept looking me over, either, like it was picking out cuts of meat. But I guess that probably comes natural when your head is a barbecue. I wondered if the rest of it was metal, or I could give it a good jab if it tried anything funny. Let's just, let's just, let's just do a smash or pass stream on the awful hospital characters. <laughs> yeah, I can't actually do that, you guys are both in a row and like three smashes max. True. Rahul said lame out. I can't actually do that, you guys are both minors. Continue conversation. Hey, quick question. Are we still on hospital grounds? Typical trainee. Of course we aren't. You are as long as you keep that funny little whore of yours anchored there, which I can see you're doing rather effortlessly. We are not of the hospital. We are of the marvelous food dream. 100% eat. It says 1,000%. Oh, 1,000% eat. What? What's that? What's what? Look, Jester Flap. If you branch correctly, you should be perceiving the meat times eternity. Flesh for a world of malinating. I mean, melanating. <laughs> you okay. won't believe. It's food. You won't believe. It's food. Uh, okay. Uh, done. I did that. Excellent. So as you can now see, Billy Blob, you provide essential food matters to the entire range, even layers where food matters are not a concept. We are the recombinators of the flesh concept. Without us, the cleaning itself would shrink and sleep and never de and never dampen again. I see, yes. That would be terrible. So what do I need to do to fix your hot dog masher and get this door guy what he wants? A cupcake or an apple wouldn't do the trick, would it? What? Of course not. He's a grinder, not a boiler. Building a reverberator ain't a simple matter, you know, especially not a grunt. Ronald said or. good to know both I and Lobato decided that Barbecue Girl had a vaguely cowgirl voice. Either. True. <laughs> we will need to conceptualize the appropriate deverberator, and unfortunately, we are not cleared for manifestation outside our conceptual zones. We will need you to bring back the correct materials from the hospital. What kind of materials? Don't sweat it, Bubble Guts. We made you a list. Rahul said shit. I didn't mean to send that yet. All good. The barbecue assured me the items on this list, on its list, would cure the meat grinder's condition, whatever that condition was supposed to be. I wasn't sure how these things were going to help, but I was taking that advice from a woman with a portable grill for a head, so whatever. Apparently, I needed... One, an eyeball's louse. Two, an object I don't need but have to hackle for. Three, a big old bucket of vomit. Four, a hair dragon's egg from the Tower of Oblivious Heads. Sound effects are really adding to this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Five, mucus from something that no longer exists. <laughs> Six to twelve, a bunch of other things, too. Amazing! I can't believe you brought everything! Even all the superfluous things! Couple of bobby pins, the idea of moistness, and... Done! One deverberator conceptualized and manifested. The stent should already be tricking the glumdroodler into a matter form. I had no idea what she was talking about, and I could barely grasp the thing I was looking at. It didn't even look all that confusing, really, but my mind just sort of refused to get a handle on it. This had better be the best damn sandwich that door has ever tasted. Same question as the text here. Oh no, what is that? <laughs> I, yeah, no, I, I, I... What the fuck? 
What else am I supposed That's to say? That's the Glum Droodler. Haha, just on schedule. Get ready to add Miser. It's a right one. I like how I like how it's how it's just a realistic image. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, oh, yeah, here's another one of the- Okay. Oh, this- the burger has been here the whole time? Yeah. I did not know. <laughs> Awful hospital gameplay going hard. <laughs> Ron this is said what that was hex cast. Duck this is from Roin. The this is what place. choose your own adventure fantasy web series where the top comment decides what happens next. PlayStation 6 graphics looking like. True. It's weak It's weakening. Consider tubes. <laughs> Speech bubbled with Hadley from the JC. True. Rahul said consider tubes. I do what? Consider them harder than you've considered them ever before. C harder than cones. Holy shit. Harder than cones? Even harder than prisms? <laughs> Tube thought? No! <laughs> what the fuck is this webcomic? <laughs> it is a masterpiece. Really? That's what I'll say. Oh, man. <laughs> that was incredible, baby, ma baby mouse. Baby mouse, are you sure you're just from a batter zone? We thought we might have to delay our next gray harvest, but you heard that crude or like it was a nag nagvalim. I still hadn't the foggiest what just happened. At least I did something good, apparently. It felt really nice to be praised by these monst- Okay, these people, I guess. The hospital workers treated me like some lowly ignorant pest, but these food guys were already feeling like friends. Fern? Fern, you know what to do. Start a socialist revolution in the hospital. <laughs> Unite the bourgeoisie. Actually, no, it's not the bourgeoisie. Unfor what the fuck am I talking about? Unfortunately, that's about to prove him. Yeah, unfortunately, that's about to prove impossible. Overthrow the bourgeoisie doctors. Hey, oh. hey. Yeah, no, Oh, by the way, wanna I want to see a cool Easter egg, by the way. What? Cover over that, Im that close-up image of BBQ Girl. The, the this? Second one down. Uh, that. Oh. Oh. Yep. It, it doesn't look... I, it, it looks like the hamburger had no idea what was going on. <laughs> He's just watching, terrified. <laughs> Rahul said, "Keep you know, hovering over seen images that in mind." And before, but you, but yeah, you kind of have a point. The hamburger is just like, wait, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Even now, you can see he kind of looks concerned. <laughs> yeah, I think that's just his Rahul default said expression, but that's still a funny observation. <laughs> oh Jesus, fuck! Oh God! Rahul said S-U-S. They're capitalist bootlickers. It's over. <laughs> it's Jover. Really? 1623 comments. I can tell that people were shocked by that moment. Most insane plot twist since Breaking Bad. Yeah. Oh Dude, shit, she died again, didn't she? You can do this, Tori. It's just like making a sandcastle. It is not. That's a very bad analogy to be using when you're constructing a human body. Rahul said keep hovering over images in mind. Oh yeah, that's probably a good idea. Oh no is right, William. <laughs> you can do this. Oh wait, you already read that. <laughs> Wake up. Oh Feels shit, as though you've been she's not independent anymore. Yeah. Feels as though you've been falling for days as you, you burst awake with a jolt. Recent events are foggy and fractured in your memory. The meat factory, that nice barbecue woman, a weird, weird monster you can barely describe. And then, how did you get here again? Wait, so does she still have the, the, the sandwich? 
Poppy Joe to give her, or was that entire thing pointless? She doesn't have it yet, but um, but she can retrieve it. Oh yeah, that's true. What's on the TV? No sooner do you notice and think about the fuzzy television than a crackling image begins to flicker in and out of the snow. A familiar pinkish purple blot with ridiculous Coke bottle glasses. Ronald said R O Y N. Your healing and or dehealing processes. <laughs> Special announcement. Today, P. Joe Day, just don't. <laughs> Aid results. <laughs> Plosive cysts. Thank you. Well, that was very comprehensible. <laughs> Check up on the nurse. Your, your first order of business is sandwich retrieval, but you need to make sure it's safe to leave the exam hall. You peep into the spleen's room to see if the trash hearse is still in there. Seems like an awfully long time has passed, hasn't it? Shouldn't she be done by now? What is she even doing in there? Rahul said Ruim. Had I just said, why mother concept being? Why would Queen Net- Shut up, Gamma. And I just said, why, mother concept being, why would Queen Nanny g f is bring me such a thoroughly deceased squamp on this only my 46th celebrationings eve? Rob like said, help, I can't hear times, myself. She silently continued thinking. Yeah, we can both hear you, Gamma, yeah, so stop you, randomly Gamma. saying Roin. Little had I realized my true gift in life was an awareness of reality's infant. I offer listen to the that am. of the usual plebeia. It looks like the coast yeah, is indefinitely stop. clear. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, so Go yeah, the the, there seems to be a burgeoning relationship Ronald between said, the sorry. nurse and the spleen. <laughs> well, at least the spleen actually has something to be happy about for one damn life. Yeah. <laughs> Go get the sandwich. I don't know why you feel such an intense dread as you approach the cafeteria. Nothing else you've seen here has filled you, you with this kind of anxiety. If only you could remember what happened on the other side of those doors. You could only seem to recall all things going well enough, even pleasant. I, I don't think that's a fair recollection at all. Yep, she has some mild amnesia, it would seem. She has a minor case of serious brain damage. <laughs> ah, yes, my favorite portal quote. <laughs> Go get the sandwich. Oh, uh, the cafeteria smells nicer. That's good. Why do you feel like this place is the death of you? I honestly think that if we... <laughs> I mean, Wheatley's one of those characters who you could just put into anything and it would automatically be funny. That's true. Yeah, kind of like Wario. Ah, uh, yes, one Joe, please. Your hamburger friend, wasn't he? He's already scooping the last sandwich onto a tray as you approach the counter, tipping his hat, isn't it? And just sort of silently staring at you, cautiously take the tray, hands shaking and nerves shot for no logical reason, right? This is another totally... image you can mouse. This is another image you can get a little Easter egg by mousing over it. Ah, uh, yeah. The sandwich doesn't seem that good. Why does it- is it colored like fern? Rahul said butt burger. Oh, you know, I think you could probably take oh, an educated fuck. guess. There's no way. No. <laughs> You're shitting me. You're pulling my leg. I am not shitting you. Okay. Is it- <laughs> my interpretation of the hat is that it's just a fucking crab that was shoved into a chef's hat. <laughs> That's really funny to imagine, so I'm just gonna pretend that. Oh. Rahul said the sloppy <laughs> okay, Joe looks like an S. I mean. Not really. Take the sandwich to the mouth monster. You turn to leave, only to find that the cafeteria doors won't budge. Oh, that was supposed to be your line, wasn't it? Oh, yeah, my bad. Ah, fuck it. Oh, sorry, kiddo. No food in the halls. What? Yeah, hands are tied. Couldn't open if I want to. You're gonna have to either leave it here or finish it. How do patients get their food, then? It's me, too. It's I'm just a door. Well, that's helpful. Put it in your bag. 
You carefully... Oh. No, go ahead. You carefully put the sandwich in your tote bag, temporarily taking something else out. The door still won't budge. It's really not looking too good. Come on, you have no idea what I went through to get this lousy thing. I have... I have no idea what I went through. Just doesn't work that way, lady. Chuck's signature sandwich doesn't leave this zone unconsumed. You know what kind of mess a sloppy joke could make out there. Now they care about cleanliness? Uh, not that kind of messy. Here's, you're screwing around with some pretty complicated zonal stuff. Too bad you're too... Too bad you're blind to the undefeatable dinner invasion. A truth power nestles in meat flesh. What the fuck? Doors bulge inward like an inflating balloon. You hear a sickening throb and begin to feel woozy, only for things to snap right back to normal, such as they were. Is there uh, another door I can talk to, please? Oh, I'm gonna want you in Cracker. Yeah, no, no problem, no. Eh, sorry, spaced off a bit there. Yeah, there's other doors. They're all gonna be me, though. I'm your only ticket in or out of this zone, whether either of us like it or not, which I do. It feels good to be needed, you know? I like how you had to pause on a line that said off a bit there. <laughs> oh my god, you're right! <laughs> Very convenient timing. So, what? I possibly literally went to hell and back for nothing? How's the other creepy talking door? No offense. Supposed to get a sloppy joe. It's this. It distinctly indicated it had one before. Well, I suppose there's always the possibility that I could feasting adventure deal. Food magic for a limited always. Cubicle delicious holds the secret to nutritious wealth. Sorry, my bad. That wouldn't work at all. In fact, you'd reverse implode, which is twice as bad as exploding. You might want to remember that for your future zonal shifts. The line's not done. Oh, <laughs> my bad. There's only one way out of here with that thing, and you're probably not gonna like it near as much as I am. It's really funny to me. Oh, God. I swear if the solution is to do... It's not, don't worry. Okay, thank God. Doors give a pause as though awaiting a response. But you're kind of out of patience. You can easily guess what they're getting at anyway. They are absolutely bent on you eating the sandwich. That's right. Uh, I thought you can hear me think. You can't hear thoughts, Goofus. They smell. Yeah, okay, that makes about as much sense, I guess. But come on, you know I can't eat it. What am I supposed to do then? Hack it back up? Oh no, gross. Nothing like that. So, the mouth guy... Forget him. But he has a key I need. No, not him. Your kid. Forget him. Eat your sandwich. You've earned it. Uh, thanks, but that's not gonna happen. Come on, you don't really need him, do you? That puny morsel would barely make a decent si slider. This is bad news for the- What? Chucks, after all we've done for you, we thought you'd at least try eating our special Joe as a healthier, more, more filling alternative. We made it special. We made it just for you. Not for some podunk one-way door in the junk layers to eat. Eat. I should have known. I should have known you things had no idea what I was doing all this for. Ah, don't be that way, Hamhawks. You don't know what you're ma what you're missing. Look how happy Gaston's been eating. Pull up a seat. You haven't had a break today. I'll rip you off your hinges if I have to. Eat your sandwich. Have it our way. Open up. Eat your sandwich. Just eat it. Eat it. Eat. Eat. 
eat, 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 eat,
Because, like, now you're saying nerd, some loser, jerk, dweeb are all saying eat anything. That's going to her not to eat it. It would be really funny True. if the door... <laughs> it would actually be so funny if that if the door's plan got ruined because he didn't realize about double negatives. That's 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 a really funny concept. I really hope that uh, whoops, happens. My hand slipped a lot. Ignore them. Take your time. You will love it. And the next one, and the next one. Grow and consume. Feast and expand. Multiply and feed with us. The unstoppable cycle of the flesh concept. The delicious all-natural truth of organic food matter. All natural. All one. The spiral of the organic. Spiraling. Spiraling. Organic. Organic. <laughs> oh, she's rebelling. I knew she could do it. She put the out of order note on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so good. That is so. That's so fucking funny. Oh my god. What, what have you done? I can't be out of order. I'm not a door, you idiot. Wait a minute. See if the intestine is. I like how that's her priority. Uh, Gaston, right? Uh, you okay? The intestine makes rude flatulent noise and slinks away like an accordion. He's probably fine. Return to the flesh door. Hey, you're back! You brought me something good, right? Floppy Joe, fresh from the cafeteria. I wrestled another door for it, I think. I don't know what it was. It... Sloppy who now? Listen, I don't know what a cafeteria is, lady, but I know a meal when I smell it. Oh no. If she dies again... Oh no, she's alive. She's just in there. Hey there, soup stuff. You sure did a number on those food dweebs. You... The interior of the monster smells sulfur sulfuric and sour. Your skin tingles unpleasantly wherever it has touched the moist, slick inner tissues. Old rotting furniture indicates that this may have been another examination room or an office. The pale thing hanging from the ceiling speaks in a very deep voice. You remember this voice. It somehow knew you were looking for your son. Great. Did I just do all that for nothing? Heck no. Haven't had entertainment like that in 50, 60,000 layers or so. You should have seen the look on your face when the barbecue kicked you in the keister. How the hell did you even see that? And why do you remember it if your friend doesn't? Oh, I remember all kinds of things I shouldn't. Heck, one of the few things I don't know is how I know so much. Guess I might be hooked up to more than just Aura. Aura? That's a name, even if she never remembers she has one. Not too bright, but she bubbles up a mean soup. I'm Lexus, what's your name? Not important. Conversation mode. I'm being digested, aren't I? Digest? Oh, you mean the souping. Yeah, I can't wait. I can tell you're gonna be real thick and creamy. Lovely. This is still part of the hospital, right? Oh, well, uh, sure, pretty sure. I mean, I know a couple of things have come around again for another souping or two. Good for the latest. Aha, uh -huh. Lexus, what do you know about my son? Oh, he's fine, I think. They got him hooked up to some weird stuff in pediatrics where they keep all those uh, uh, little, fat little soup wads they never share. You shudder a bit at that last part, but your heart pounds at the prospect of some answers. What else? Please. <laughs> the little guy of the bow tie was pretty worked up about it. Should have seen the blockhead squawking. Not that I get any of that techie talk. We even brought out the unexistalizer in case things go south. Is that what it sounds like? Search me. They never used it before. Phage fought tooth and nail over it. <laughs> For a moment, you lose control. You have come with some colorful things to say about the small doctor and probably throw a thing or two across the room, but you're not really paying attention to yourself. You just kind of let it out a while. Long, awkward silence follows.
Haha, <laughs> yeah, that guy's a massive tool, right? Doubt he'd even supify any good. I was I was about to say something, and then I remembered that it said a long, awkward silence followed. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I took that opportunity to take a bite out of my dinner. <laughs> Perfect. You said the key would help me. How? I don't know how. I just know what will. I told you, I just know stuff. Do you know the combination to the maternity ward? Have I seen it? Sure, lots of times. Do I know what any of those damn squiggles mean? No, they all look the same to me. I ain't even got eyes, lady. You, you just said you saw it. The other kind of saw it. The fuck does that mean? Okay. Oh, no, no, nobody here makes any sense. I can't imagine they would to a gray zoner. What's a gray zoner? What even is a zone? Oh, that's easy. Just describe what an internet meme is to a shoebox full of moths that can only hear nouns, and you'll probably come up with an analogy. <laughs> yeah, that's at least ironically wrong. Fine, forget it. If I'm going to be here for a while, can you tell me anything about Dr. Mann? What's with him and Phage? Oh, I can never taste of the grease ball. You never know with those two, really. Phage barely cares enough to prestige the guy, usually. Of course, even Man was completely against the unexistalizers, and it was unethical, said it wouldn't work anyway. But he sure he was trying to sabotage the thing not long before he last came to. By the way, nice job again. I, I don't think this hospital is really concerned with ethics. I don't even understand what happened back there. I remember falling? Head long into a deep fryer. Smelled delicious. How do I keep coming back? That doesn't sound like something you can fix with surgery. Oh, you'll see pretty soon. What was that thing in the cafeteria? I just remember it in pieces. The doors wouldn't let me leave, and then they, I don't know, I remember it like I clawed out of a nasty dream, and now the cafeteria is just gone. Sorry, that'd be another one for the moths. The air, the air in here is the air in here is getting increasingly heavy and humid, reeking of bile. It makes you itch all over and stings your throat and lungs. You know you might wake up again, but you're not particularly looking forward to supification. Yeah, no, it doesn't sound very good. What's going on in the chat? Um, no one is there, so that answers that question. Smashing success. Collect items. Before you forget, you grab the key off the rotting desk and shove it into your bag. Acquired morgue key! Also search the pile of junk for or anything else interesting. You'll find mostly garbage and handfuls of pulp that may have once been papers. In the back of one drawer, however, is something resembling a metal file folder. It won't open, but it has what appears Rahul to be Rahul said you're almost getting to the Acquired 200 rock page. file. I might end the stream by 200. Yeah, that's not But it has what appears to be a key. Yeah, okay. What were you just saying? I, I missed it. I was saying I might end the stream at page 2. Uh, there's gonna be a pretty good stopping place soon. I, uh, <laughs> okay. Point. Ponder and escape. You don't really care if you keep coming back or not. You plan to do as little dying as possible, and you were never a big fan of being slowly dissolved. Your feet are really starting to sting on the spongy floor. So, I don't suppose you could tell me how long I have before, um, the soup thing, huh? 50, maybe 60 layers, I'd say. I have no idea what that means. A whole lot more time than you've been here. Lexus puts an exaggerated patronizing emphasis on time as though mocking the very concept. Can I ask what happens to, uh, the leftovers? The waste? It comes back out the same way it went in, doesn't yours? Sure, why not? How do you feel about polyps, by the way? Stomach polyps? Well, I don't smell anything good in this, but we are fans, to put it mildly. Our colorectal polyp. Mmm, smooth and sweet. Fatty, too. Go straight to my waist, just the way I like it. You could swear for a moment. Oh, my bad. <clears throat> you could swear for a moment that you hear something like a hiss... Something hissed like a cat from the general vicinity of where your tote bag tends to manifest. You know, funny thing, Aura said she had no idea what you were. Well, her brain's not where it used to be. Not that it ever was, Stella. Mm -mm. She can't even remember. She has a name half the time. 
About all she used to remember was the cafeteria food before somebody hilariously trashed the place. It was all she ever talked about. Lexus, will it ever be Sloppy Joe Day again? Mysterious voice with no name that I'm, I'm aware of. Do you think they're having Sloppy Joes right now? Mom, where are my legs? Haha, <laughs> what a big dummy. <laughs> You don't really want to hurt these creatures if there's any way to get out peacefully, but your options seem to be dwindling, and you're quickly feeling weak. It's not just the, that the vapors sting. Oh dear, something wrong. Is he? Oh. Really did. Yeah, that's the neurotoxin, sorry. The what? Every scientist in Aperture Science Labs in 1999. <laughs> True. <laughs> The what? You said I had time! Until your hot fret are the frothies do, sure. You just won't be awake for it. Nothing personal, they just tend to get a little violent near the end, especially when they know they're they won't come back. We gotta eat too, you know. You begin- oh. You begin to reach for your weapon, but you only stumble a little. You don't even care. It very silently feels like there's nothing more important than just lying down and sleeping. Bye bye. Oh, Maya's geez. screaming to get back up and fight your way out, but you don't. Your consciousness fades and you feel like you're floating away to some other place. Oh, wait, I should probably. Now, a dream sequence. Raul said, hover over the images. I have it's done a flashback that. from the perspective. Yeah, it's a flashback from the perspective. Raul said, all of them. Yeah, and not all necessarily right. all of them, but most of them. But yeah, yeah. This is a flashback from the perspective of Fe of Fern's son. Don't worry, I'm more than prepared for flashbacks. I've watched Demon Slayer. <laughs> yeah, and I've watched One Piece. There's just like an unending amount of flashbacks. Well, actually, there's even more of them in Mob in the Mob Psycho Netflix adaptation. Because, <laughs> I mean, Demon Slayer only plays flashbacks when they're necessary. Bob Ron Psycho is a Netflix hover. adaptation. Literally play flashback every time it reminds you, it tries to remind you of a scene. Yeah, but you don't happened. have to alert. Yeah, but yeah, he I heard know. you. He heard you the first time. And also, this isn't one of the images that that you have to that so you can hover over. Bex and I watched the Mob Psycho adaptation, and literally every there's like a flashback every single time someone is talking about an event that happened in the past. Like, you can just be talking about the most casual thing ever, and there's just a sudden flashback to that thing happening. <laughs> Nothing is allowed yeah, to be Ikusaba, the 16th student. Yeah, Mukuro Ikusaba, the 15th student hidden somewhere in this school. The one they call the ultimate despair. Watch out for her. <laughs> True. I don't know what that means, but that's funny. It's a reference to Dang and Rob, but they flash. <laughs> they, 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 there's a scene where someone says that, and then they flash back to it like five times over the course of Ron 20 minutes. Ron said, gun, run, pot. Okay. Okay, what was happening to Fern's son? Something very bad, obviously. Yeah. He's sick, and she can't figure out what it is. Oh, here's the first one you can hover over the, the images. Oh god, that's mm -hmm. I kinda wish I didn't hover over that now. <laughs> there's another this. one. Oh. I really should stop doing this. I'm ruining my own <coughs> I'm gonna give myself nightmares. But you're missing out on so many cool things. Is this one also a hoverable? Right, this one isn't hoverable. Uh Oh. This is moderately disturbing. I might get sick from this. Well, more sick. I'm actually already not feeling too well. This is a perfect time to oh, be reading oh, wait, wait, Hospital, wait, huh? wait a little bit on this one. Just watch it carefully and wait a bit. Oh! Five nights that's what at you were waiting. <laughs> yeah, that's what it was you were waiting for. Page. Five Raul said, pages. shit, I forgot to tell you, but... What? Raul said, there's a lot of funny comments. I, 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 I try to avoid... 
down to the comments because I don't Rahul really said, and we're forgetting to read them. That's true, yeah. That might, it's fine. I can read them on my own, don't worry. Yeah. Just tell me whenever there's a hoverable. Holy fuck, Huggy you've Wuggy! Already seen all the you've already seen all the hoverables now, don't worry, but yeah. It's <laughs> but Huggy you're right, it's Huggy Wuggy. Time. Rahul said Huggy Wuggy. Honestly, I am a huge Poppy Playtime apologist, honestly. Rahul said from Poppy Playtime. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> Oh, God. Oh. What? Yes, but no, hold on, Dad. I, I'm, I'm still... I have another in a moment. sad cameo. Yeah. Anyway, so... So, yeah, this, we just need to just read this one scene, and then, and then we can finish up there. Right. Sounds good. That's one juicy-looking pooch. One's lunch. Are you sure that's what that is? I thought their dogs and their offspring were two different things. It's the Grey Range dog. It's all dog. All of it's delicious. In uh, your perception, perhaps. Grey is more subjective than the true perception range. Oh, here we go, Mr. Theory of the Day calendar. The uh, word you intended was hypothesis, but there are no oh, mere hypotheses. All that can be imagined already must exist in one perception or another, or uh, nothing else could exist that would ever conceive of it. In fact, the uh, gray itself may Dr. serve Dr. as... Uh, let's hit this guy with a nerd emoji real quick. Whatever, guys! Just fill the holes in. Or drill at some holes. Drill at some holes and fill them Ronald in. It'll be nerd fine. Face. True. Did it come with its progenitor? Why don't we just stick it back where it came from? Problem solved. You don't even know what to call this problem yet, do we? If we were dealing with a husk shuffler or something from the pseudo-seething, we could at least walk backwards from its lime warble and trace its bore patterns. But this is unprecedented. This is independent of the things I recall. It could spread. It could have already spread, and we could never even know. Keep watch for suspect activity. Remember your oath. Suspect? Sus? Oh, God damn it. Cure, contain, or race. Cure, contain, or race. Cure, contain, or race. Cure, contain, or race. Rahul said, wait and a second, we'll can I there. say something? Yeah, sure. On a scale uh, of what 1 is to 10, it? How, how valuable do you... Rahul said, can you open up the first page on another tab? What do you mean, the first page of what? Of the entire webcomic? Rahul said the very first page. Okay. Do I click next, or is that where we're stopping? That's where we're stopping. Okay, I'm going to go to the archive and then open up the very first page. This one? This is the one you were talking about. First page. What? Rahul said Fern is blue, but her baby is green. Oh yeah, that's true. So, did Fern get whatever? Rahul the baby said, had? but then she turns green. Yeah, that's. Also, oh, Fern yeah, must have caught a... whatever the baby had then. Yeah, that seems. Yeah, something like that seems to be happening. I'm anyway, very bye, guys. curious. I'm... To what's going on in the in the, in the awful hospital storyline? Yeah, we we're gonna end the stream there. So yeah, that's goodbye, we're ending fellows. The stream. All right, see you guys. See ya. All right, Pete. One. Yeah, it was. Yeah, what's what was your fate? What's been your favorite awful hospital moment so far? Uh, the burger seduction montage. <laughs> yeah, that's what I expected. <laughs> oh, that was so funny. <laughs> anyway, bye. All right, see ya. Uh, also, see you, Gamma. Thanks for the sound effects. Alright, that'll be the end of today's stream. Uh